your house in half. It's dead small. They won't stupid. Hey, that's enough. Your dad hates your mum, that's why they've cut up your house. But my mum's coming home soon, ain't she, Grandma? Look, uh, just help me, will you, sweetheart? Carry the jam and the butter into the kitchen for me. I asked you a question! Hey, Amy. Amy's stupid. Oi! Now, will you go upstairs and get your gym things, please? Ah! Oh. Ah! You know, I hope he's not taking things out on Amy. Ah, he's fine. Uh, Lovey, will you go upstairs, please, and clean your teeth? Ah! Oh. Ah! You know, I'm going to have to have a word with Peter. He can't just dump Simon here. That is different. I am trying to make my marriage work. Peter has brought this on himself. The Ash, Eccles. Eccles, come here. Eccles, let go. She's not yours. She's Grandma Deirdre's. You're cruel. Holding her, even though she wants to come to me. She doesn't. See? Then she's as stupid as you. You're the stupidest. You get it off your dad. He's in prison for being stupid. It's a crime. He's guilty. Shut up. He's in stupid prison. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Shut up, shut up, shut up! Seriously, can't you two just both play nice? Simon's hurting her, so she won't come here. Hurting Eccles? No, that I know is a big fat fib. <laughs> Do it in your room. You. Or what's your to carry the telly upstairs? Do it in your own room, in your own home. Oh, I forgot you haven't got one. My mum says you've been kicked out. Well, your mum's talking through her backside, as usual. I heard her. Leanne said that she wanted to send you back to your dad's, but he doesn't want you either. Yeah, that's why I'd be down to stay. He wants me to meet his new girlfriend. But I didn't want to live down there. I'd miss you too much. Get off! Get off! Mum! Simon! Amy, what on earth is going on? Stop it. I'm not doing anything. You're taking up all the room. I need it. I'm doing my homework. Well, so am I. I won't tell you again. This is my house, not yours. Do you think I like being here with you? Then go home. Oh, I forgot. No one wants you there either. Shut your mouth! What are you doing? I'm calling my mum and I'm going to tell her what you've just done. Put it down. Drop dead. I said put it down. From the start then, none of this would have happened. I'm sorry, OK? I'll fix it. How? If you think things are bad now, they're going to be even worse when you tell your parents the truth. Well, I've got to tell you know who. Are you joking? He's the baby's dad. I've got to say something. <sighs> no, you don't. You keep your mouth shut and you forget it ever happened. Well, what if he finds out? He won't. Amy, you can't tell him I'm being serious. You don't know him as well as I do. Right. I think you two better start talking. No more lies. Who's the dad? It's not up to me. Tell me. Calm. Amy, how can you just stand there and let him take the blame? I'm sorry. Joe, you know, I am so disappointed in you. And do you know that right, well, he had a proper girlfriend? He's a virgin. Did you know that? Well, she does now. Cheers. Do you know what? I'm not doing this again. Right, Simon, don't go. Oh, wait. No, you aren't going anywhere until you tell me who the dad is. Get out of my way. Well, day's not over yet. He sent the girlfriend to finish the job. Watch it or am I? Oi, oi, oi. You come in here and start threatening him. What's got into you, Amy? Not what? Who? Did he tell you what he said to Jacob? Well, he told me they had words, yeah. But after what him and his gang did to us, can you blame him? Jacob's just as damaged by that as you are. He's a victim too. Oh, poor little Jacob. He still did them things and he's still doing them. He's changed, what, in the last hour? Cos Simon's nose didn't bust by itself. What, like, Simon's never raised his hands to someone? No, but he's always had you to put him right. Jacob hasn't got anyone. Excuses. You didn't tell her, did you? Oh, there's nothing to tell. I'd never call my cousin anything like that. Like what? Eh? Amy didn't say that you called her anything. 